everyone, welcome to today's advanced class, okay? Um, so today we are going to be covering some kicking drills, okay? Um, and then we're going to finish off with our backwards break fall and our technical stand-up. And if we get a little bit of time at the end, I will be covering some nunchucks um, as well. But see, it's how much we can get through before we can do that, okay? So let's get ourselves nice and warm. I hope you guys are all having a good morning so far. So hands on our hips, look over our shoulder and change and change and change. Roll our head down the semicircle and change and change and change. Okay, arms in front, big circles forward with your arms. Okay, a little bit faster and as fast as you guys can go. And backwards, get a little bit faster and as fast as you can go, that's it. Okay, now hands on your hips, roll your hips around one way and go back around the other way and back around the other way. Good morning, Jen. Good, good morning, Cordelia. Okay guys, feet together. Okay, 40 star jumps, 10 towards me, 10 to the side, 10 to the back, and then 10 to the other side. Okay, you ready? 40 star jumps, and go. As many as you can do. So 10 to the front, 10 to the side, 10 to the back, and then 10 to the other side. That's it. Keep going, guys. Hi Luke, how are you? You okay? Good, that's it. Keep going, guys. You're doing well. So 10 star jumps towards me. 10 to the side, 10 to the back, and then 10 to the other side. Well done, I'll give you guys 10 more seconds to do them. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and time. Well done everyone. Okay guys, so we are gonna do a two minute warm up. <laughs> my timer on my watch, okay? So first exercise I want you to do is frog jumps. You're gonna crouch down like a frog and drive up to get them legs nice and warm, okay? 30 seconds on the clock, frog jumps. That's it, as many frog jumps as you can do in 30 seconds. That's it everyone, you've got 20 seconds left of this round. Keep going, dig deep, good. 15 seconds now everyone, keep going. That's it, last 10 now, 10 seconds left. Good, you're doing well. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Well done guys. Okay, we're gonna do 30 seconds of shoulder tap. So, you're gonna go into a pushing position. Keep your core nice and still, and lift your hands to your opposite shoulder. 30 seconds, as many as you can do, okay? 30 seconds on the clock, ready, go. That's it. Good, keep going. You got 25 seconds left, everyone. Dig deep. That's it. Keep going. 15 seconds. That's you doing well, everyone. Dig deep. 10 seconds left. Okay, so for the next 30 seconds, all I want you guys to do 
is your uh, bridge, okay? So you can lift your feet, uh, sorry, lift your feet on the floor, lift your bum off the ground, and lean over as far as you can. You're gonna do 30 seconds, as many as you can do, okay? Ready, 30 seconds of bridge. Ready, go. That's it, so bum off the floor, reach it all the way over. That's it, good, keep going. 15 seconds left, guys. Doing well. 10 seconds, push out. Good. drill we're going to do is we're going to do a sit out drill okay so all we're going to do is we're going to go uh, into a turtle position here hands on the floor bum in the air sit your leg through so we're here then sit your leg through to the opposite side okay so watch again hands on the floor bare position the leg goes through to the opposite side so if you're with your right leg go through to your left side so we're here then left leg comes through to the opposite side and we're back into the original position, okay? Ready guys, 30 seconds, have a little practice, go. That's it. Good, keep going guys. You've got 15 seconds, keep going. Practice this sit out. That's it, let me know you're getting the hang of it. Post a comment in the box. onto our knees, okay? Then we're gonna roll back forwards by going onto our shoulder, roll over and back. Okay, so 30 seconds of just forwards and back rolls. Remember going over your shoulder, don't go over your head, okay? Ready, go, 30 seconds, give it a go everyone. So forwards and back, or backwards and forwards. Just like that. After you go in. Doing well, 15 seconds. Well done, guys. 
guys, good work, okay? Last one, all I want you guys to do is you're just gonna move your ankles like this and then you're gonna go back the opposite way, okay? And we're just gonna do 30 seconds of this, okay? As many as we can in 30 seconds, do a few one way and then go back the opposite way, it's just good for coordination, okay? Ready? And go, 30 seconds. Good, keep going everyone. Moving them ankles. Good, keep going, dig deep. 10 seconds now. Good, five. through all of our basic strikes okay so in your own time have a little drink and then we will move on okay guys so when I say garden stand you put your left leg in front right leg behind hands up and we are gonna shout I already garden stands out so left leg in front right leg behind I've got my right leg in front because I'm mirroring you guys consciously it helps you learn quicker okay so left jab to my count every time i say a number each and then straight back ready arm one good two that's it three four last one five okay keep that hand up on your head as well okay right cross that make sure you pivot on the ball of our foot but also make sure that our hip is moving forwards into the punch otherwise if you're not your hips not moving you're not going to get that power okay so when i say one each arm back ready one good two that's it three excellent four last one five okay this time put our jab cross together okay so when i say one each each and then back ready one good and again two excellent three that's it four Good, five. Good, now left hook now, so twist both of them feet. One of my pet hates is people not twisting their feet on their hook. You must twist both, okay? So when I say one, each, and then back. Ready, one. Good, two, that's it, three. So our hips are turning. Wherever your hips face, that's where your power's going, okay? Ready, four. Good, five. Okay, jab, cross, hook now. So when I say one, each, 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 okay, ready? And one, good, and again, two, that's it, three, excellent, four, good, last one guys, five, good, okay, right up a cut now, when I say one, each, and then back, ready, one, good, two, excellent, three, drive them hips, ready, four, good, five, Okay, jab, cross, hook, uppercut now, okay? So when I say one, ish, 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 okay? Ready? And one. Good. And again, two. Excellent. Three. Doing well. Ready? And four. Good. Five. Excellent. Okay, guys, I'm going to put a timer on for a minute, okay? If I say one, I want you to do your jab. If I say two, you're going to go jab cross. If I say three, jab cross hook. And if I say four, you're going to go jab cross hook uppercut. At any point, you might say jump, duck, or sprawl. So jump is jump, duck is duck, sprawl hips to the floor, and then back up as fast as you can, okay? So you've got one minute on the clock. Ready? Hands up. Two. Good. So that's jab cross. Three. Jab cross hook. Jump. Duck. Sprawl. One. Three. Four. Good. Two. Jump. Duck. Sprawl. Sprawl. Four. So jab, cross, hook, up, cut. Two. Three. One. One, one. Good. Two. Four. Jump. Sprawl. Duck. Basic kicks, okay? So garden stands. Okay, every time I say a number, 
turn and kick off our left leg. Remember we should be kicking with our shin um, or the top of our foot, but our toes need to be pulled back because if our toes are up, you'll hurt them, okay? So when I say one, each, and then one. I'm just fix my pants and fall down. Okay, you ready? And two. Good. Three. Excellent. Four. Good. Five. Well done. And switch our feet to right leg in front now. Same kick. Ready? One. Good. Two. That's a note I'm stepping in this back foot. Isn't facing the same direction as my front foot. Ready? Three. Good. Four. Excellent. Five. And switch. Okay, side kick. Stepping in on behind. Remember, never stepping in front. Try and get our back foot to face away from our front foot. So when I say one, each, and then one. Ready? One. Good, kick with that heel. Two. Good. Three. Excellent. Four. Good. Five. And switch. Off our right leg. Ready? One. Good. Two. Excellent. Three. Good. Four. Well done. Ready? Five. And switch. Okay, axe kick off our left leg now. Axe kick. Okay, ready? And one. Good. And again, two. That's it. Make sure half switching, not full switching. Ready? Three. Excellent. Four. Well done. Five. And switch. Right leg in front. Same kick off our right leg. Ready? And one. Good. Two. That's it. Three. Four. Last one. Five. Excellent. Well done. Okay, guys, have a good drink if you need one. And I'm going to go through some kicking drills. So, guys, we're going to cover some different kicking drills now. These kicking drills are sparring drills. So, when we return to class and we do some sparring, we, these kicks, these drills are really effective for sparring, okay? So we're gonna start off with our axe kick cross combination. Okay, so the whole point of the axe kick is to get someone to drop their hands away from their face, or if you're super flexible, land it on the head, and if we were in a kickboxing competition, you'd score points for that, okay? If, however, you're not very flexible, the point of it is to get them to move their hands away, okay? So, we're gonna do our axe kick. As soon as our axe kick lands, you're gonna throw your right cross, okay? So, we're gonna go axe kick, cross. Good, and again, axe kick, as soon as that foot lands, throw that cross. So as soon as their hands have dropped, you then give them a nice big punch uh, to the head guard um, as, as, as you land that, that, land that kick, okay? So. All we're going to do every time I say a number, axe kick, right cross, okay? Ready? Let's do it to my count. Ready? One. Axe kick, cross. Good. And again, two. Axe kick, cross. Three. And again, four. Axe kick, cross. Ready? Last one. Five. Axe kick, cross. Well done. Now. For the next 30 seconds, I want you all to practice the axe kick cross combination, okay? So for 30 seconds, practice axe kick as soon as that foot lands, throw that right cross, ready? And go, 30 seconds on the clock, have a little practice. So as soon as that foot lands, you wanna be throwing that right cross. Good, keep going everyone. Practice and throw that axe kick as soon as it lands, you wanna be following on with that cross. Keep going. You're doing well. That's it, guys. You've got 10 seconds left. Keep drilling it. Good. Excellent. Good. Three, two, one, and time. Well done. Great work, okay? So this time, okay, we are going to do something called a hook kick, okay? So a hook kick is like a turning kick, but you hit him with the other part of your foot, okay? So you hit him with the bottom of your foot. So all we're going to do, we're going to be on our toes, our front leg is going to come up and round, and then we land, okay? So instead of our turning kick being like this, our hook kick, we bring it round the opposite way, and it flicks round, okay? So we're nice and fast, we're here, lift our leg up, round, and land, okay? So watch again, round, and land, okay? So, for 30 seconds, we're going to practice that, then we're going to do some reps of it, okay? So all you guys are going to do, leg up, Flick it round, 
land. Okay? So practice in your own time, practice the hook kick. Ready? And go. 30 seconds. Let me know if you're getting the hang of this kick. Pop your comments uh, in the comments box. Good. So just lift that leg up, round and land. So I want to be nice and fast. Good. Keep going. Good. Excellent work. Good. 10 seconds left, guys. Keep going. That's it. So flicking that leg round. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Okay, guys, so every time I say a number, I want you to be nice and light on your feet, swing your leg round, and land, okay? Hook kick, okay? Ready? And one. Good. Two. That's it. So flicking that leg round. Ready? Three. Good. Four. Five. Excellent. Make it nice and fast. So be nice and light on the balls of your feet. Ready? And six. Good. Flip that leg round. Seven. Good. Eight. That's it. Ready? And nine. Last one. Ten. Good. Now this time, this is going to require a little bit of balance. Before you do your hook kick, okay, um, you're going to do your turning kick, okay? So we're going to step and imagine we try to do the kick, but it's not working. We flick our leg round at the last second. So watch again. So we try and do the front turning kick. So we stare. We kick, flick our leg round. So try and keep your knee as still as possible in one spot. If your knee moves up and down, that's what causes you to lose balance, okay? So, turning kick, hook kick, okay? So, for 30 seconds, practice it. So throw the turning kick, then flick our leg round into the hook kick. Okay, ready? And go, 30 seconds in your own time. So. Do that turning kick and then hook kick. Good. That's it, you're doing well. Good, you've got 20 seconds left, everyone. Keep going. So there's a practice of throw your kick, your turning kick first, and then throw your hook kick on the end. That's it. Good. Five seconds now, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. And time. Well done. Good work. Okay, guys. So every time I say a number, turn and kick, hook kick. Okay. Try and do it to my count. Ready? And one. Good. So throw the kick and then hook kick. Good. Two. That's it. Turn and kick, then hook kick. Good. Three. That's it. You're doing well. Ready? Four. That's it. Excellent. Ready? Five. Good. Six, that's it. Seven, good. Eight, well done. Ready and nine. Last one, guys. Ten, good. Excellent stuff. Okay, guys, well done. Okay, so this time we're going to do the opposite. So you're going to throw your hook kick first and then come back with your turning kick. Okay, so it looks like this. So we're going to go hook kick, turning kick. Good. And again, watch. So we're stepping in. So we're going hook kick, turning kick. So we're flicking our leg around first, and then as it comes back, we're throwing the kick. Okay, once again, you need to keep your chamber nice and still. If your leg moves up and down, that's what's going to cause you to lose your balance, okay? So for 30 seconds, that's what I want you guys to practice. Hook kick, turning kick, okay? Ready? And go. 30 seconds on the clock. Go. That's it, keep going. Excellent. Let me know if you're getting the hang of these kicks, guys. So hook kick first, and then our turning kick. Good. Keep going, everyone. You're doing well. You got 15 seconds left. 15 seconds, everyone. Good. 10 seconds now. Five, four, three, two, one. And time. Well done, guys. Great work, okay? So, guys, every time I say a number, you're going to go hook, kick, turn, and kick to my account, okay? Try and do it without losing your balance, okay? So, when I say one, hook, kick, turn, kick. See this knee? It's staying nice and still. If my leg moves up and down, my hips start to move, and that's what causes me to lose balance, okay? So, when I say one, ish, ish, and one. Ready? And one. Good. And you can do this with whatever leg you want to do it with. You can do it with your left leg or your right leg. Just make sure whatever leg you're doing it with is in front. Ready? And two. Good. Three. That's it. Good. Four. Well done. Ready?
ready? Five. That's it. Six. Good. Seven. Eight. Well done. Ready? Nine. Good. Last one, guys. Ten. Excellent work. Okay, so, so far we've covered the axe kick cross combination. We've learned the hook kick. We did turning kick into hook kick, and then we've done hook kick into turning kick, okay? Last combo I'm gonna show you today is the side kick, spin and back kick, back fist combination, okay? So, we're gonna step in or behind, so we're stepping forwards on this kick, okay? Not in front, but we wanna make sure our kick's going forwards, we're not just static with the kick. So we're gonna go side kick, land, spin and back kick. As soon as our foot lands, okay, instead of throwing a jab, we're going to do something called a back fist. So we're just hitting with the back of our hand like this. We're just flicking it out, okay? So, watch again, okay? So, we're on our toes, so we're going to throw side kick, land. Spin and back kick, land. Back fist, okay? So when we're sparring, you ideally want to throw combinations rather than single shots all the time, okay? Because then it's harder for your opponent to defend combinations than it is just to defend single shots, okay? So, do it with me, ready? So everyone go side kick, land, look over your back shoulder, spin a back kick, land, and then back fist. Good. And again, ready? So go side kick, land, look over our shoulder, spin a back kick, land, back fist. I'm doing that quite slow so you guys can get the hang of it but obviously we were sparring we will be doing this combo nice and fast okay so for 30 seconds give it a practice in your own time side kick spin a back kick back fist okay 30 seconds on the clock ready go give it a whirl 30 seconds oh I've dropped my bottle lid keep going guys good you got 20 seconds left 20 seconds Good, keep going. 10 seconds left now. That's it. You're doing well. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Well done. Okay, guys, garden stance. Aya. Okay, so every time I say a number, side kick, spin back kick, back fist. Make it nice and fast now, okay? Ready? And one. Side kick, spin back kick, back fist. Well done. Ready? And two. Good, side kick, spin and back kick, back fist. Well done, great work. Ready, three. Side kick, spin and back kick, back fist. Okay, start to build up the speed now. Ready, four. Good. A little bit faster now, five. That's it, you might be getting a little bit dizzy. We just shake it off. We've got five more reps. Ready, and six. Good. Seven, side kick, spin and back kick, back fist. Good, build up the speed now. Ready and eight. Well done. Side kick, spin back kick, back fist. Ready, nine. Good. Last one, guys, make it your best. Ready, 10. Excellent work, well done, great stuff, okay? So guys, let's recap on the kicks we've learned today. So the first combo we've learned is the axe kick, cross combination. You can build on that as well. You might throw a cross, hook, cross, okay and make it more complex okay the next kick we learned was the hook kicks we learned it on its own then we put it together with our turning kicks we did turning kick hook kick then we did hook kick into the turning kick and then we did side kick spin and back kick back fist okay so you've learned a few different drills now that you can implement when you spar obviously you have to practice them um, to remember them okay so guys, unfortunately we ran out of time there for today's lesson. I did have the intention of doing back break full and technical stand up, but we will do that on our next class, okay? So guys, great work today. Hope you've enjoyed the session. Hope you've picked up the kicks um, quite well. Um, we've got our women's only self-defense seminar in 15 minutes time, okay? Um, I would recommend teenagers only and adults for the seminar. Um, no young children, so I'd say like 13 and up. Um, that would be great. It's live on YouTube as well, so if you've got any friends or family that would like to take part, they are more than welcome to do that via YouTube, okay? So guys, great work today. Uh, let's finish off with our bow. So repeat after me, say our bow for respect. I practice martial arts for peace and for honor. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you guys soon.